Hey class, I hope all of you are doing well. All of you are in my thoughts. I um, hope everybody's staying safe, uh, healthy, wash your hands. Um, I just wanted to create this video to show you the changes in the syllabus and how we're going to move forward when you guys come back from spring break next week. Unfortunately, as you know or you're not aware, all classes are online for the rest of the semester. So this is the way it's going to be. I apologize for the light on the background and also the reflection in my glasses. Um, try to find a better spot, but right now this is the only place I can record. The library shut down and no Starbucks or anything else. Okay, moving on. So I'm going to pull up the revised syllabus and this video will be sent out an email and on the syllabus and the syllabus will be updated to Blackboard shortly. All right. So um, I'm going to go over this and show you guys what I've done so far. So as of Monday, March 23rd, our class will move to an online only format. Lectures will be pre-recorded and students will watch and then respond to the videos in a discussion board. These discussions will count as class participation and attendance. All lecture videos will be recorded and posted by class time. So the lesson for Tuesday will be posted by 4.30 p.m. It's just gonna be me talking over the slides, showing you examples, same thing in class, only in a video. Students will then have three days, Friday and Sunday. Um, so if the Tuesday video you have until Friday to respond, end of the day, 11.59, um, at least two full paragraphs. Everything will be organized on Blackboard by week and class. I'm gonna show you that, show you that um, in a bit. Um, okay, moving on. Um, the discussion board will count as a class participation and attendance, so you're gonna wanna do that. On top of this, I'm gonna make myself available for live Q&A sessions in the start of each class to discuss assignments, class examples, memes, or whatever. I can chat for the entire class time, but if no one joins after 10 minutes, I am going to log off. I will also be available via phone conference, Skype, or FaceTime by appointment, however you guys need to reach me, I'm here. Um, in this part in the syllabus, I'm going to embed the YouTube link to this video. So media blogs. Media blogs would be the same. It's the same thing posted on discussion board. Instead of calling on somebody to go over their media blog, I'm going to read it. So when you post a media blog, go into a little bit more detail about what the article is about and what the meme, the background of the meme. Um, I also had to make some adjustments for the two people that were scheduled to go uh, last week on the 12th and 14th you're now going in um in may so please check that those two people everybody else is still on their original day and most of the people have already gone on the media blog so thank you for that um we will have one exam we'll, that will be done during blackboard it'll be super easy the class before the exam we're going to have an online video chat and there's going to be a google doc set up so the way that i uh review for my all my tests even in class is that you break up into groups um, I post the question topics and via shared Google Doc, you guys fill in the answers. Um, we're going to just do that collectively uh, via the online video chat. Um, and it's up to you guys. If nobody fills it out, you won't know the answer. Um, and all the slides will be posted online uh, that cover the test, and it'll be sort of a thing where we collectively get the answers. There'll be no surprises. 25 multiple choice questions. I might make it even 20 to make it easier. We'll go over that when the time comes more. All right, so going down into the syllabus. The original syllabus is here for reference. So you can just skip all of that. There's a note that I want to go over. So due to current circumstances, students can now be graded with a pass or fail or a letter grade. This is up to your discretion. So this class is an easy A. Just finish the work that we have to do for the rest of the semester. I know it's not an easy situation um but get it done if you see yourself struggling and you don't want it to affect your gpa you can get a pass or fail i've also been told that at this point uh the withdrawal from classes uh has been extended i don't know the due date but if you think outside circumstances are really going to affect you with what's going on please withdraw from the class otherwise you can get a pass or fail that won't affect your gpa or take the easy a if, you, if you're committed to doing the work because you still have to do the work I'm also giving, I'm also giving uh, consideration on late assignments due to all that's going on, but you must be diligent in reaching out to me. Let me know, I have to move, 
my family member sick or something and I'll work with you. We can even go into the end of the summer and beyond, uh, maybe get a pending grade or something like that if something arises. So you'll see the break in the syllabus after the March uh, spring break. So here it is. I just wanted to go over this before I show you what's going on in Blackboard. Um, you'll see the schedule here, paper outline. Um, there's going to be two or three classes where we're going to watch a movie. So, you know, I'm so, I really want to see the Goonies with you guys, but I can't find that online. I can't stream it in one of these videos because I could be sued for copyright and I don't want that. So I'm going to give you guys some options to whether you have Netflix, uh, Hulu, or Amazon Prime, um, what you can see and you'll write a discussion, you'll write a journal. Same thing for a TV show. I'll give you guys a few options. You pick one, watch it, just write a response. Um, on April 7th, note, we're having a live class and everybody should be in this, should join in and help uh, build the test review. If you're not able to join this live class because of something that's going on, um, the video, would, the live class would be recorded and saved. Google Doc is always there for you. April 9th, test via Blackboard. Easy test, easy 100. Um, I'm not sure if Blackboard's gonna lock you down, but if it doesn't, I don't care. Whatever's going on, do what you have to do to get the, <laughs> to get the answers. Um, so yeah, that outline is due uh, March 26th via Blackboard, and I'll show you how it's gonna be turned in. Um, thank you to those of you who did it already. If you haven't done it, let's get started on it. The actual paper is gonna be due April 16th via Blackboard. Um, we're gonna have, also when we have the review, we're gonna get into group projects. So a lot of, all of you should be here, join the group project, join the live class on April 7th. If not, um, I'm making the groups, um, I'm trying to break up the groups that you guys have already in class, what you had. April 30th, we'll have an online class, uh, open online class to prep for the group presentations, any questions that you have, whatever. Um, note that because of the schedule, we had to use one of our two our snow days. The last snow day is May 8th for Friday. That's when you guys are gonna post your group presentations. There's no final exam for this class. You just have the historical media paper, the test, group presentations, and you'll have a final journal that's gonna be due May 12th by 6 p.m. What are you gonna do? Just watch an episode of Black Mirror on Netflix. Any episode that you choose, write a two-page journal about it, and we'll go over that more later. Um, if you don't have Netflix, please email me and I'll find something else for you to do. All right, so I wanted to show you how Blackboard's gonna look now. That, um, give me one second. All right, this is not active in Blackboard yet. I have to post it. But when we go into Blackboard, you're gonna see something, you're gonna see weeks now. It's gonna have week seven through week 14. You're going to click on that week when it's active, and you're going to see our class broken into two days, Tuesday and Thursday. So you click on the first week. First thing you're going to see is a link to Blackboard Collaborate Ultra. This link is so that we can meet and chat, and you don't need to download anything on your computer. If you, only down, if you can only join via audio, okay. If you can only join, if you want to turn off your video, okay. Once you open that link, you'll see the Q&A here and you can join it. Um, we can't join it because it hasn't started yet. And actually, I'm gonna change the time so you can come in about 10 minutes earlier. All right. Going back to week seven, you're gonna see a link. It's either gonna be a Kratura link with my pre-recorded lecture or it's gonna be a YouTube link. It might uh, alternate. I'm just trying to find the best uh, recording software that we have because we show a lot of videos. I'll also post a document listing all those videos so you can see it clearer if you want. Under that video, you're gonna see the March 24th discussion. You're gonna create a new thread, respond at least two full paragraphs. So for the movie class, oh, I love the Goonies, blah, blah, blah. When I grew up, I remember going to the movies. Uh, I remember going to the Zigfield Theater whatever. Make sure that it's an adequate response. Um, using the group 
a presentation response where people have to respond. You don't want to tell somebody, oh, I love the colors on your project. That's not an adequate response. Um, you know, give something substantial. Going back, you'll see assignments here that we have to turn in. I'm going to move this to the actual day that is due, but this is just an example. Um, you'll attach it, boom, and I'll download it and grade it. The discussion board, the media blog is still there. The link to the assignments are still there. So it was Whitney and Matthews. Apologies, apologies to Whitney and Matthew. I'm sorry that I had to move you guys. Um, excuse me, but we did not have class that day. Um, and that's pretty much it. Um, you'll see the class slides. I continue to post the class slides here. Um, anything you guys need, uh, feel free to email me. Let me know what's going on. Um, looking forward to having you in class next week. Um, that's pretty much it. Talk to you guys later.